Hello, welcome to day 11 of our 21 days of prayer and fasting. We've made it through the middle. And uh, so we are uh, on day 11 of our uh, 21 days of prayer and fasting. Today we're going to be praying about new churches and church planters. And this is one that I love. I love this theme and this topic. It's near and dear to my heart because we were church planters uh, at one time uh, here at the Intersection Church. And we believe in church planting. We, we continually give to it and uh, uh invest in it and it's a huge thing for us around here at the intersection so today we're going to be praying uh, for new churches and church planters to not only come out of our body but the the church in general and we're going to understand why in just a minute uh today's scripture is found in luke chapter 14 verses 20 uh verse 23 and uh, jesus is telling a story in this passage of scripture about uh a, a person a master uh who invites uh all these people to come to his house for a party uh, and those people say they're too busy or they have lots of excuses and uh, uh, after the invites go out nobody uh, from the initial crowd wants to come well the master is is furious and he says uh, this is unacceptable we need uh, people to come so send out the word to invite anyone to come the poor the sick uh, send out the word to everyone that they can come and be a part of this party. And this verse that we're praying today is actually Luke chapter 14, verse 23, where the master says, please go out and uh, go and invite all these uh, people because I want the key verse. I want my house to be filled so that my house will be full. And I believe God wants a full house. He, he desires for more and more people to know uh, who he is and he wants to be a blessing to them and that's the power of a church plant uh, church plant is a unique expression it's a unique invitation to god's house and every time a new church is planted in a town or community uh, the pastor of that church and the body of that church uh, has a unique expression or invitation uh, to the gospel, to the good news. And so that's why we're going to be praying for this today. So let's pray that God's house would be full, that there would be new expressions or invitations uh, that would be sent out into our communities, to the streets and the highways and the byways. And let's go after God today. Father, we ask that your, uh, your desire to see your house full would be fulfilled. Your will be done in the earth today. Jesus, we want to be a part of that. Help our church, the Intersection Church, or whichever church we may represent, help our churches to be uh, involved in investing and giving and raising up leaders who will go out. Help us to be churches who send others out. And uh, God, help us to be uh, people who invest in the next invitation, the next expression of your uh, house. And God, as we do that, uh, we pray along with you, in agreement with you, that your house would be full. And so let's pray the prayer together uh, to finish out today on the uh, prayer guide. Jesus, you love the church and you gave your life for her. Raise up men and women who will give their lives up for her as church planters and pastors. Let life-giving, Holy Spirit-filled churches come from our own body for many years to come. As a church, we desire to be fruitful and multiply, leading new friends to Jesus at every turn. God, we say that, we, we commit that out loud in prayer, and we ask that you would do that through us. God, we bless you and we thank you for it in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. All right, well, here we go. Day 11. If you are uh, kind of struggling with your fast, you jump back in. Uh, there's still a, the, the second half to go. So uh, jump back in with your fast. Uh, stay strong. Challenge yourself. Uh, make sure you take time to pray throughout the day uh, whenever you're feeling hungry, whenever you're feeling uh, that, th those hunger pains or, or a desire for the thing that you're fasting. Let's give ourselves to God in a new way uh, in these last few days. And uh, before we know it, day 21 will be here. So let's make the most out of this time. All right. God bless you guys. Have a great day.